What's up, everybody, and welcome to the Dog Pound. I am M Dog. This is Tammy. I ain't even looking at it, but I can look at that. I punch her right in the chin. You sound like you almost forgot my name. I didn't forget you. How did I forget your name? You said Tammy. 30 years, and I didn't forget nobody's name. Today, we're lucky enough to have the FN 509cc Edge that we're going to do a review on. It is chambered in 9mm. It is fairly new to the market. The 509cc Edge, as you can see, she is clear. Is mostly known for its built-on compensator that is supposed to be one of the latest and greatest advancements in handgun technology. We will talk more about the compensator in a minute. But first, let's go over the things you get with the purchase of one of these guns. It comes with your soft FN case, which is, I think, pretty typical of an FN, you know, FN purchase. You get four red dot mounting plates that come with your case and the gun. You get two interchangeable back straps with it. So this little, the back strap right here pops off and then you can change that, change that out however, whatever to fit your hand the best. You get two 15 round magazines and one 12 round magazine. In some areas you can get uh, three 10 round magazines and that's because that's if you live in a state that, that only allows up to a 10 round capacity. So I think that's good for you guys. You got your owner's manual that comes along with it. Other information that you may need like your warranty information so on and so forth. It is also, it also has a locking device so you can safely store your firearm when not in use. Disclaimer, we here at the Dog Pound highly recommend that you read your firearms owner's manual and follow all safety measures for properly using and storing your firearms. Treat every firearm as if it is loaded and get properly trained by a certified firearm instructor. End of disclaimer. Would you like that? <laughs> now, instead of me sitting here and reading all these stupid specs to you guys, we're just going to roll through them for you here on the video. But before we do that, please hit that subscribe button and smash that old like button here on the video. It is the easiest way for you to help the channel and to help keep us moving in the right direction. And we are truly grateful for your support. Now, here's your specs. Now that you've checked out the specs on the FN 509cc Edge, let's talk a little bit about this new compensator. I'm running out of daylight, I'm going to take it apart for you guys, but we're just going to talk about it a little bit before we shoot it. The compensator cuts down on muzzle flip by 25%, enabling faster, more accurate shots at speed. Because of this feature, the felt recoil on the shooter's hand is dramatically reduced. That's a great thing. We will put this to the test today since I have never fired this pistol yet. So any mishaps or malfunctions we will see together as we always do in live action. For, day, for today's review, we will be shooting 125 grain TPJ's total polymer jacketed bullets. Blue bullets. That's the actual name of the company, I'm not just being funny. Blue boy, it anyway. These here are TPJs from Minuteman Munitions. I will be posting up a video review of our first official product review on this ammo in the very near future. Now, let's go take care of business and shoot this thing. All right, so here we go. First time out of the box the FN 509 CC Edge. That compensator is so cool looking. I don't know. I just want to sit and look at it. Take it apart. Blue bullets. Minuteman munitions. 125 grain TPJ. Woo! 
Whew, works good. The sights has that co-witness sight, and I'm not used to shooting co-witness sights. Very seldom do I use a red dot, but they are very nice sights, as you can see. This here is the 12 round mag, two 15 round mags and a 12 round. Very, very nice shooting gun. Very little flip in the muzzle at all. I'm impressed. Very nice. Easy to come back on target once you pull the trigger. Slide release, which is very rare anymore. This slide release works so perfect. So easy. I got a couple travelers, but like I said, I'm still trying to get used to the sights. But man, it's smooth, real smooth. You can see a difference with that compensator. The group is good. Like I said, I had a couple travelers just trying to feel my way around the sights. I'm gonna put Tammy on the business end and let her sling some lead down range here. And uh, we'll see how she does with it. I'm sure she's gonna like it too. Okay. You sure you don't want to let me play with this gun? You know, by the time you seem to let me play with your guns, you yeah, seem to like them. Oh, that is a nice tall. My goodness. Put down my pocket. <laughs> what the heck? This is starting to get dangerous. I'm, I'm have a few accessories to take home here. All right. 
So, now let's see. It does take a little bit with that bite. But, this is a nice gun. If it goes missing one day, just know she's safe. Okay? I know you better keep off of it. <laughs> I'll bring it back, but... I like it. I mean, you know, it's not my cannon, but I like it. It's a nice gun. I mean, the recoil was nice, but you know, I limp wristed it at that time. I have weak wrists, weak wrists. But yeah, no, it's it's a nice gun. It's smooth. It's um. And it's pretty, you know, not that guys care about us women, it's kind of pretty, but the recoil was good. I mean, I think it's a, it would be a popular gun for a lot of people, yeah. You ever uh, shoot it again? Oh yeah. Yeah, it didn't cause me physical harm. Now, it did kick back a few casings on me, but I'll forgive it. So, I'm sure I've got a few in the jacket somewhere. So, it's a good, it's nice, nice gun. We've put 60 rounds down, down range so far. We haven't had any issues whatsoever with the gun. The gun is smooth. Um, before I came to the range today, I always take the guns, take them apart, use ballastol, and clean them up pretty well, just because that's how I am. Uh, I don't know. I like to look over. It gives me a chance to look over the firearm before we actually come to the range. And honestly, I've identified problems that way before. So if, you know, call me crazy but it is what it is uh i i enjoy cleaning the guns and i do it even before i come to the range and then i do it again when i go home always look over the fires make sure there's no issues whatsoever but uh so far this thing is firing very nice very nice i am impressed uh with this cc edge so we're gonna put these 15 down range we're gonna send them it's time to let her eat. We'll see how well she does eat. Weapon is clear. That wasn't the gun, that was me. My finger got a little wobbly, so. What can you say, man? That is one fine piece of machinery. And the 125 grain TPJ ammo, total polymer jacketed bullets from Minuteman Ammunitions with this weapon, man, that's a, that's a duo right there. So absolutely phenomenal and uh, highly recommend. Dog pound approved. Welcome back to the kennels, guys, for the final thoughts. So what do you guys think of the FN9, FN 509cc Edge? What is your opinion on the use of the compensator? Last but definitely not least, do you guys think that the CC Edge pistol, do you think you would buy it? And do you think it's worth the suggested retail price of $1,500? That's a question you gotta ask and you better ask your wife. 
you don't ask your wife and you your butt goes and spends fifteen hundred dollars you may want well to make sure your life insurance is paid up but she's not saying that because she's thinking how did i get this so either way we're not going to discuss that at this time i'll handle that later you know like a man Either way, we <laughs> just don't discuss it, period. Right. Make sure to leave our com your comments or questions in the comments section of the video. I will respond to your comments quick, fast, and in a hurry. <laughs> Quicker than a hiccup. I want to say thank you to our product sponsors who have helped us along the way. Steel's Gun Shop and Lewis. Uh, Hi, Mr. Charlie. See? Every time, Charlie. Love Mr. Charlie. She loves you, Mr. Charlie. So give Charlie or Austin a call. Let them help you with your next firearm purchase. They are a great family-oriented business that's been in the industry for over 50 years. You can find them on Facebook or give them a call at the number listed at the closing, in the, in the closing, whatever they call it, credits. That's what I meant. Their number's right there. Give them a call. Tell them M-Dog sent you. And Tammy, because Tammy loves Mr. Charlie. She likes you too, Austin, so don't, yeah, you know. I like Austin. I love Mr. I always got to remind her of that. Either way, that's that's a shame. Splatterburst Targets. You can find them on various social media platforms and at splatterbursttargets.com. Tactinet Brass Catchers. We didn't get a chance to use them a day, but they've always been a big help and support to the channel. Look them up at tactinetus.com. And, of course, our favorite gun lubricant, multi-purpose lubricant in the world, Ballastol. Ballastol, our cleaning is our clean go-to cleaner for lubricants, helps us take care of our prized possessions, our firearms, after we dirty them bad boys, all up like that. It's all nasty. $1,500. Look like that. That's ridiculous. Please don't keep repeating that price. <laughs> Most of all, I want to thank all you guys for watching our videos, sharing your thoughts and experience with us. We always love to hear from you guys. Please do so. Uh, let us know if we're screwing up or doing something right. Always fight for your Second Amendment rights. You guys are the best. May you live as long as you want, never want as long as you live. Be safe. Shoot straight. Shoot often. Take your wife to the range. Make a fool of yourself. Spend $1,700. Or, or, mm. What? Shh. I'm in the doghouse now. Thanks to you all. I was trying to share some knowledge with you, and it's look what it got me. I'm Either way, I'm 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 out. So have fun. God bless. We gone. FN 509CC Edge with the compensator, and boom, we gone.